All right, welcome back to Ocarina of Time. Now that we have our hookshot, we can do some plot stuff. But not in the order you expect. Normally they told you to go to the Forest Temple first, but I'm not. <laughs> Instead, I'm what, going to go do what the, are we ice, doing first? the Ice Cavern. Well, We're going, going to the late... The oh, wait, I know. You're going to the Ice... The cavern. mini Ice Dungeon. That's what right? I just said. <laughs> Pay attention. Well, you kind of cut off there. It's not Ted's fault. Bah, yeah, oh, yeah. I can't climb a fence, really. Well, that's why having a jump button would be nice. More like Link should just be able to climb over it himself, but whatever. Yep. <laughs> Failure. No, can you use not. the Coco as, uh, like, um, yeah, to make longer jumps? You can, yeah. Okay, well then... Not that I need it, I already got the heart piece. Well, still, it'd be more convenient. You could get across things a little bit faster. Mm -hmm. mm. Walking. Oh, snow. See, mm. now the water's cold, Lewis. Yeah, I think it's always been cold, and it just got colder. I like how the I like how the blue chicken has a like blatantly Japanese name to it. Kohiro. It's like <laughs> it's like one of the only things in the game that has a blatantly Japanese name, apart from, like, Okiri and, um... Well, it's, uh, Link, uh, Zelda has always been more, uh, Western fantasy, so it's not really that surprising to me that it's, uh, it hasn't had too much oh. Japanese-sounding oh, stuff. Oh god, all the today. Zoras are trapped under I there. Know. Global warming? No! no. <laughs> <laughs> Funny how global warming ends with everything getting colder. <laughs> Don't blame me, blame Al Gore. <laughs> oh good, the king is frozen today. <laughs> Imagine Red ice. That. Huh. Looks like someone's been playing black too. <laughs> or was it white too? It's it's lucky he didn't he was too lazy to like slide back over and block off the pa passage. He was sitting there for seven years. <laughs> And ice area, because I didn't want to make a full-on ice dungeon. Oh, what was the reasoning for this place being frozen over? Ganondorf cursed it, because the Zoras wouldn't obey him. It, it, uh, uh, you ever seen The Lion King, Johnny? Yes. You know how everything's suddenly dark and evil when Scar takes over, and it just magically gets better when Simba beats him? It's kind of like that. Uh, I see. So there is no logic. It's magic, <laughs> too. With whimsy. <laughs> Heart piece, out in the open. Oh great, automatic jumping on ice physics. <laughs> Not that hard. At least you'll never slip off the edge. <laughs> <laughs> See, got a, he's got a point there. <laughs> point one for Ocarina of Time. <laughs> yeah, but you but due to the ice... Oh, and rotating platforms? <laughs> Maybe you just suck at this game, because I'm having no problems. Well, let's see. How many times have you played and beaten this game before, Ryan? So I didn't I have no any problems when I played this, and I've only played it once. So there, Ted. No. <laughs> <laughs> for <laughs> mind, alone. <laughs> mind you, you are right. Those mechanics do have, you know, some potential to get really dickish, but it never really has the chance to in this game. Well, it's always been dickish with me. That's why I fucking hate it. We. Whack. What did that snowman ever do to you? He could potentially freeze me today, like that. Okay, well now he did it, but that other one didn't do anything to you. He froze That's because me. we preempted the guy. He froze me today. You can't arrest someone for the thing that they might have done. Someone's never seen Minority Report. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, I haven't. Whoa, he's very on guard. <laughs> he's very slowly Ow. coming my way. Totally Blind sighted. <laughs> <laughs> I totally saw that coming. Have at you! <laughs> it's only a flesh wound. I didn't see that one coming, though. It happens, unfortunately. <laughs> Ugh, slippery ice physics. Indeed. Wait, what, a turbine? What? It's like walking on a freshly mopped floor. Wait, what?! <laughs> <laughs> you can duck under it, but yep. you're too tall t to logically duck under it. Yep. So it just sort of clips through your neck. Yep. <laughs> that that sounds like it should be more deadly. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, 
you could logically be saved um, if if you were treated quickly after having your your legs cut off. But uh, if you have your head cut off, that's kind of the end. <laughs> Woo, I jumped off only to climb back up. Such great dungeon <laughs> design there, folks. And you know, all they had to do, really, to fix that, is put the, f put the fan up a little bit higher. Meh. So, it's like, you can't even say, but it was an N64 game, so that clipping is to be expected. No, it has nothing to do with the hardware. <laughs> they just got goofed. You're going to harp on that all part, aren't you? No, I'm done. Sure you are. Oh, and now it's now it's a now it's blue fire. Ice What's that? It's ice. Well, it looks like blue fire, which technically means it's even hotter than the I other fire. Get closer so the hook shot will kill you. There we go. Since I don't have the bow and arrow yet, which you're normally supposed to have, I have to use the hook shot as my projectile. I, I you end up using it as a projectile more often than not anyway. Yeah, it is very convenient. It doesn't have an ammo count. Yeah. <laughs> but it has it does have some amount of limited range. Well, I mean, once you get the long shot, it's about long enough for anything that you'd yeah. need to uh, lock on with anyway. That you really only need to use the bow and arrow for stuff all the way across the room for puzzles and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> and this is why you want three bottles for the game. Well, other than having them is just convenient. Yep. Okay, tennis rackets, hold the blue fire. Cause that makes sense. Come on, tennis rackets, hold more mm, blue fire. I want more! <laughs> it makes about as much sense as that one spell on Harry Potter that did, that did this exact same thing. <laughs> oh, god damn it. <sighs> oh, ice physics and slipper in small platforms. Hooray! No, this doesn't have ice physics. This is oh, no. God, Sonic the Werehog before Sonic the Werehog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hot, hot, hot. Nope, it's a You're cool. Like, oh, that that way. On fire. I probably should have dumped it other somewhere other than on my own feet. It's a cool flame. It's blue, well, you know. <laughs> no, blue flames are hotter than red flames. I know that's the joke. They, call, they describe it as a cool flame. It's not. <laughs> cool fire? Well, it's 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 like, you know, it's magical. the lingo, dude. Cool and hot mean the same thing. It's magic with whimsy. <laughs> Have you ever noticed that words for that words that are supposed to be bad end up being synonyms for cool? Like ill, sick, wicked. Welcome to the well, 80s, Ted. I or never, fat. I, I never understood how ill can be something <laughs> that stands for good. You haven't seen enough uh, 90s stuff, then. I don't think anyone's ever used the word ill as a synonym for cool, have they? I've, I've heard ill. Uh, they have. I've heard illin. <laughs> really? Yeah. I've heard sick, but not ill. Because ill just doesn't have that cool sound to it, you know? <laughs> So why does only specific stuff get uh, melted by the fire? Shouldn't everything? Because it's specific, that's why. Because programming, that's why. One of the easiest heart pieces to get in the game. Because there's a blue flame generator right next to it, so you have no excuse for not having any. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure there was an easier one to get. There was, yeah. Wasn't there one of them that was just sort of lying out there? I think so, but it's one of the easiest. Do, 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 do. I'm getting Super Metroid flashbacks. <laughs> Wait, why do you automatically have a map for this area? Because Failure. I got the, I got the no, I or got the map. I got the map. You weren't paying attention. Well, it all kind of blends together after a while. It was the first thing he got with the blue flames. Yep. Oh yeah. Pay attention, Ted. We're watching the video for a reason. Well, I don't know. It's just something about Zelda makes me makes my eyes automatically glaze over. Like history class? No, I actually liked history class. Well, actually, I should rephrase. I liked history <laughs> class when I didn't hate my teacher. <laughs> you have a sniper rifle sight locked on your head. 
History... I had one ever since the beginning of the Zelda 1 playthrough. <laughs> History is the most interesting class in school. It just gets plagued by the least interesting teachers. Yeah. Duh. God damn bats. They drive me to trick. <laughs> no, it wasn't that sentence didn't start with confound those. I don't know, no matter. I, I look for any reason to get annoyed to drink. <laughs> You need well, a reason to drink. At least they're not. Yes. At least they're not ponies, Don. <laughs> Confound those ponies. <laughs> they drive everyone to drink. So, oh, this is the oh, those. This is the block sliding pu puzzle. Yep. Um. Hmm. For how some reason, the, how much are the silver ones worth? They're not anything. Fifty. No, they're not. These are they're these are plot. You need to collect these in order to open advance. the door. Yeah, ah. I know they're worth something though. They're worth they're worth fifty if you get them in an actual treasure chest in the overworld. But these I silver see. rupees are plot MacGuffin ones, so silver rupees actually don't appear in this game as far as monetary value goes. Well, if that's the case, then why couldn't they make them something else? Because if you're playing the game normally, you might just think that they're rupees and you won't try to go for them. If they made them something else that's collectible, well, you can't, you can't advance the, until you get them. The different, the, the different chime you get when you collect it is supposed to signify it's some different. importance. Yeah. I guess. That and the fact that your rupee... Oh, wait, you're already at max. So max, 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 max anyway. Yeah. Oh, I, was, I wasn't feeling that. Let me try it again. <laughs> Yep. Push. Tom. Why can't we get on our belly and slide forward? At least we don't need. At least we don't need strength for this. You have the you have the power bl bracelet. It's ex it's essentially the same thing. I well, suppose. Well, you know, no matter how much strength you have, if the thing is heavier than you, all you're going to succeed in doing is making your feet slip all over the ice. Da, 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 da. <laughs> when do you get the fourth bottle? I don't. You don't. No. Why to not? The, to get the fourth battle, you have to ride around the overworld and get all ten big pose. That's incredibly yeah. tedious, and I'm not doing it, because I have three, which is enough. But you could have four. I only have Edit. three item slots. Edit. 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 No, I'm not getting the fourth battle. It's pointless. I have three. I don't need more than that. The time you would spend getting that fourth bottle is it's easily a... negated by the time you'll save not, not getting, getting it. it. Yeah. It's not that useful that it's that it'd be worth the time. It'd be nice to have an extra fairy, just in case. I don't suck the ga at Zelda games like you do, Ted. Everyone burn. makes burn. mistakes, Ryan. Burn like this red ice. It doesn't what? burn, it it just melts. Ooh, I got all three at once. Burning. <laughs> no, it burns too. Link is that bad in the kitchen. Ooh, pretty. <laughs> he burns. Oh! Ice. White wolf! It's exactly the same as the old wolf, though, so... It's just bigger and takes more hits to kill. It's pretty much yeah, the you same. Also have, you also have the Master Sword. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I don't know why the mini-boss music is playing. Well, it is a mini-boss. It's the boss of a mini-dungeon. Well, no, then it's just the boss. It's not... The mini-boss is something in the middle. It's I love just punching the... shit out of those with Goron, like... Yeah. It gives you Diku nuts. Why? It just it. We, oh. <laughs> can you? You can still use Diku nuts as adult Link, right? Yes. You uh, got the not. iron boots. <laughs> they don't get heavy until you put them on for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't you ever played Monkey Island? <laughs> oh, good grief! You snuck up on me again, dude. It's almost like you're a ninja or something. At least he's not wearing bright orange. Yay. Yeah. I, yeah, oh nice. wait, they're they're frozen under ice. Oh, of all the Zori you could have rescued, why did it have to be the one who wants to become my stalker or something? Cuz he's the sage. Oh, we don't know that yet. I There's think no it way was she pretty could have. Wait, tell me this isn't going to become a running theme. Don't tell me all of the sages have a crush on Link. <laughs> that would be creepy with Tarunia. <laughs> Uh, he he pretty much does have one. Have you listened to how he talks about him? True. 
That would be why Link ran away screaming the last time. <laughs> so now we've got our warp point to the water dungeon. Yep. And yeah, now we get. I I I like the I like having these warp points, but the thing is, you get them so close to the dungeons anyway that they never really end up being too useful, except for the one that takes you back to the Temple of Time. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's just like when you get warp points, they're supposed to be helpful, but when you get you don't really have any reason to go back to any. You're someone who doesn't do any side quests whatsoever. They're convenient mm -hmm. if you're doing extra things. Yep. Well, I mean, like, I, just playing the game normally, I never found much use for those uh, songs. Smoke bomb! Bang. You know, she, the door was locked, so she couldn't have gone anywhere. How do you know? Because <laughs> the door was locked, she wouldn't have been able she, to go. She, she used the magical magic of Windows Media, movie, movie Maker Transitions. <laughs> Which one? The uh, the page peel? Or, or the uh, uh, Windows crash feature? Wait, why aren't you... Oh, yeah. No, the one that makes the screen go white for a second. Take off the boots. Yeah, this is annoying. This is the one thing they legitimately fixed upon in the 3DS version. Well, what? Uh, oh, the, uh... they, they made the boots actual items instead of equipment. Oh, okay. You have to keep equipping and unequipping. Yep. Oh, that's something that they improved on in later Zelda games com entirely, so... Yeah. 